Welcome back, everybody. Check out Bell with Mid-George Ambulance joins us to focus on women and heart attacks and really some tips because women experience this completely differently um, than guys. Yeah, they do. Um, usually it's just a mild discomfort for women. Uh, it's not a sharp pain. It's not a really sharp onset of pain like, um, like most men have. Pretty um, easy to write it off. It is. It's very easy to write it off as gas or, you know, indigestion or sure. something like that. So. We've, uh, we've got some video mm -hmm. and this is really kind of gives you a real life scenario of you're at work yeah. and you could start to feel this. Yeah, I mean, you know, what we have is uh, our patient, you know, at work and, and just not feeling, you know, quite there. Uh, something, something a little off, you know, a little hot flashes. Um, and uh, a coworker comes in and sees, you know, something going on. That jaw, I mean, she yeah. kind of says her jaw and her arm her, there. Her arm is hurting a little bit. She uh, gives her some water, um, you know, Let's, let's see if we can take care of this. this. The important part, though, is what she recognized. She saw something's not right. I'm going to call 911. You know, I'm going to see what's going on. Um, she's staying on the phone with our dispatch, talking to our dispatch, answering the questions that they're going to ask, because they're going to ask those questions um, that's going to tell us, okay, maybe this is something serious. Maybe this is a heart attack. Um, just comfort the patient. Stay with them. Um, of course, you know, you're not always going to be in a situation where there's going to be a couch or, you know, a bed to lie down in. But, I would imagine you, know, you would fight the person, too, because nobody wants to think they're having a heart attack. Exactly. You yeah. know, they might say, hey, maybe not. You know, I don't think that's necessary. But, you know, try and keep them comfortable. Get them lying down in a comfortable position and uh, and wait for wait for us to get there. That kind of seems, I mean, you saw her fanning the person mm -hmm. and you're like, oh, come on, really? Yep. But you really have a sudden onset of feeling you hot, do. I would imagine. You yeah. really do. Um, some of the symptoms that you're gonna experience is you're gonna experience, you know, like, like you said, the pain in the jaw. Most of the time it's in the left side. Uh, a, a, a soreness or an aching in the shoulder, uh, maybe all the way down the arm. Um, hot flashes, you know, just really a sudden onset of sweating, maybe a little bit of nausea to go along with that. Um, Is that kind of the, the, the connect, the light bulb moment? If you notice that side, that left side of your body and going, oh, jaw and arm pain, this could be something besides maybe TMJ or menopause or something like that. It, it can be. The important thing to know is that, you know, not everybody is going to show signs exactly the same. And I tell people constantly, if it's something that's abnormal for you, let us be the deciding factor. Right. You know, just give us a call. You know, it won't take two seconds, pick up the phone, dial 911. We're more than happy to come out and talk to you about what's going on. All right, Chuck, good stuff. Really, be mindful of what's going on with your body. Definitely. We'll see you next time. All right. All right.